today is day two of my shoot with Optimum Nutrition at Bodybuilding.com. For those of you that are new to my channel, thank you so much for watching. And for those of you that are not new, thank you so much for always coming back. I love you guys so much. I am an Optimum Nutrition athlete as well as a Bodybuilding.com athlete. So I figured, why not do a day in the life of a Bodybuilding.com and Optimum Nutrition athlete? So that's exactly what we're gonna do. Yesterday's vlog was a little bit of behind the scenes of what goes on in a photo shoot, but today's gonna be a little bit deeper. What we do, how we do it, why we do it. We're doing more um, intense gym workouts today. So I figured today would be a better day to shoot. First things first, woke up at six o'clock, not that early today, thankfully. Usually it's around five, 5.30 call time, but today it's seven since everyone's here already. But we're gonna go into bodybuilding.com headquarters, get my makeup done, and start shooting literally right away. So I hope you guys enjoy this video, and let's get to work. And we have Lindsay over there. Hello. She has pretty much, well, she's pretty much been the makeup artist for bodybuilding.com for how long now? Oh gosh, long time. A long, long time. Long, 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 long time. <laughs> and then that's the lovely Crystal <laughs> getting her makeup done. <laughs> so this is the first step. If you're a woman, you get your makeup done bright and early in the morning. Today was not that early of a call time, which is nice. Usually they've been like, fine, 5.30. And you just like walk into like their hotel rooms <laughs> holding coffee. <laughs> um, but today it's it's fine. It's seven o'clock. Um, yeah, we're gonna get our makeup done and then head straight to our first location. So I'll probably see you guys after makeup is done. Dylan will end his junior year. Okay, you're gonna. This is the new way to do makeup. Pregnancy issues. <laughs> Seriously. I'm gonna start a new service. Like I mean, this is pretty comfy. We are. Walking towards the Hummer. So Bible.com has this super wrapped or super cool wrapped Hummer that they change throughout the years. And wow, I look really funny right now with the sun and the shadows. But anyway. gym here in Boise. It's a beautiful gym, awesome space. We've got some turf over here, some treadmill, some bikes, um, and then over here we have all the racks and everything. And like I said earlier today, me and Alex, the other athlete I'll be working with, uh, we're doing more power lifting, more hit workouts, more explosive stuff, which I'm really, really excited about. Whereas yesterday was more lifestyle, more outside shots. So if you are interested in seeing that, I'll link that video in my bio so you guys can check it out. This is a photographer I'm working with today. This is Eric. He's okay. the best. He's been working for Bodybuilding.com for how long? Uh, over seven and a half years. Holy moly! So he is one of the resident photographers for Bodybuilding.com. So yeah, I'm gonna change into my stuff and get ready to shoot. All right, so we are ready to go. This is look one, just wearing high-waisted leggings with an optimum nutrition shirt. I'm gonna be changing back and forth between Bodybuilding.com and Optimum and also just generic workout clothes. But I had an idea, I wanted to introduce you guys to some people that are huge, huge components of a photo shoot. So people only think that it's like a model and a photographer, where in fact it's a lot more people than that. So, here's the first person. Do you want to introduce yourself and tell us what you do? Hi, my name is Ray, um, senior graphic designer for Bodyline.com. He's pretty much in charge of this whole photo shoot, like his vision, so he will be behind the camera asking me and the photographer to get some shots, so, I get to boss these guys around yeah. today. So, <laughs> you met uh, Eric, he was a photographer that I'm going to be working with today. And then we have two more people. We have Colin over there, and somebody else that I haven't quite met yet, but they don't want to be on video. So, um, they're ones that make sure lighting is right, make sure that um, because we also have lights on here, we have that giant one up there and then down there. This gym is really well lit, so we don't have, we don't need that much light. We just need to be able to balance out the shadows and um, just tone it down a little bit or brighten it up. So that's that. They're getting the set ready for us. I think we're starting with squats. So that's why they're over here. They've got all the camera set up, all the equipment set up. Let's get a little bit closer to see if we can get it. 
So we have this light up there, then we have these lights right here, and then they'll take a picture and then it'll come up on the on the laptop back here so they can see if they need to adjust any lighting or if, you know the poses or whatever it is. So that's a little bit of how they set everything up, but without any further ado. So since we are filming like squats and deadlifts and stuff today, I'm warming up. So I'm starting with some foam rolling, and then doing some stretching, and then starting light with the lifts, and then I'm trying to go as heavy as possible to get some good pictures. I was doing some squats, went really, really well. You probably saw some behind the scenes footage, but I wanted to let you know that my camera just like died on me. It, not like battery died, but like it dropped like that much off the floor and it's kaput. So I'm gonna be filming on my iPhone now. Hopefully the quality is okay, but I did wanna get this video up to you guys and show you a little behind the scenes of the life of an athlete here. So um, if the quality is not as good, I apologize, but I'm gonna try my very best to make it worth your while. So they are now changing the set. We're gonna do deadlifts now. And uh, Alex will be going first, I'll be after. So this is it, hurry up and wait. Now I get to do nothing for a little bit. <laughs> Moving on to our second outfit change. I'm just wearing the same black pants and I'm actually wearing my sample crop top from my clothing brand. It's called Avavi, for those of you that are new here. Um, it hasn't, it's not out yet. We're still in the process of rebranding and bringing everything out, but this is just a sample piece. Um, but anyway, uh, we're moving on to um, like sled pushes, walking lunges, things of that nature. Behind the scenes, they are just moving all the lighting and stuff, so now we're just literally sitting around waiting. Um, I'm getting kind of hungry, uh, so I'm gonna see if I can snack on something, but maybe I'll have some protein almonds. For those of you that know how much I love them, I have them with me all the time, but we'll see. Uh, yeah, that's it, wanted to update you guys real quick. See you guys soon. <laughs> Update. We're just sitting. <laughs> Alex, say hi. Hello. Hurry up and wait is the name of the game. <laughs> uh, they are changing the set right now. It's, uh, I think we're doing, this is probably not the best angle. <laughs> we're doing battle ropes right now, so they're making sure the lighting is good for that. And we're just here chilling and waiting. We have an hour left here, and then we're going to lunch at bodybuilding.com headquarters, and then staying there the rest of the day to shoot some at the gym there. So that's the update. Yeah. Just trying to stay warm so I don't hurt myself. Um, stretching and the sales. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> Alex, how's it going? It's going great. How do you enjoy your time being here in Boise, Idaho, shooting with Optimum and Bodybuilding.com? It's good. I took a three hour nap last night. And <laughs> you guys went to the gym, I'm like, I'm taking my nap, I'm finishing my book. and yeah. That's how you get swole, by taking yeah, naps. Taking nap. You do, you really do though. I know, you, you, you need do. A recovery. You're right, you're right. All right, we'll see you guys. Day is complete. We are in the van. Done. Done. I thought you were gonna say dun, 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 dun. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> but Lunch we're gonna time. go, yes, to headquarters, grab some food, and do it all over again. At even, better. even better. Even better. <laughs> My makeup is really nice. <laughs> so funny story. No, I guess it's not a funny story. Our makeup artist, she was like feeling really sick this morning. So she literally did this in like 10 minutes. This is impressive. Wow. Um, naturally beautiful. You don't need to make it. Oh, that's making it into the video thing. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Hello, we are now in uh, by the way, not com headquarters. I just finished lunch. They got us like this, uh, like a rice bowl with some chicken, some veggies. Went down the hatch really fast. But here I am sitting with Sarah. Hello. And do you want to talk about what you do? Yeah, so my title is community and social media manager. So I have the team. Um, Ryan Weaver's on my team, he does transformation challenges, uh, our YouTube manager's on my team, and then all of social. So I have customer service reps that work in social, um, and we have a team down there, and then I have a team upstairs. Um, and yeah, so we handle all of the content that's going out on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, all of it. So you should, you're gonna post me every single day? Every day. Every single day. Yeah. Yeah, because, yeah. <laughs> we just reviewed uh, some of the 250K, um, I guess, finalists. Yeah. And the transformations are freaking wild it's like, awesome can't wait till they announce it because it's just like we're headed out blown. next week so. yeah so they're going i guess door to door to the winners to congratulate them and give them like the checks and everything so it's a really cool experience if you've yeah. never done a challenge with bodybuilding.com you should do it that's yeah. how i started <laughs> so <laughs> and I, look where i am now <laughs> okay anyway we're gonna <laughs> chill for a little bit i'm gonna try to get some coffee and finish the day Goodbye. What's up guys, we are here. They're setting up all the equipment back here. Literally been waiting um, for like, wow, it's 1.45 right now. So we've been here for about an hour and a half, kind of just hanging out, not doing much, which is nice to kind of rest and stuff. I was doing a little work, um, doing some client check-ins while I waited, and now I'm eating more. <laughs> if you follow my Instagram or YouTube or whatever, you'll know that I eat these all the time. Um, it's my preferred snack these days because it's, I love almonds, but I never ate them because they weren't so balanced. Um, I was always missing a lot of protein in my diet when I would eat the like nuts and stuff. So these protein almonds came out recently and I haven't, well, they have three flavors. My favorite is a dark chocolate truffle flavor. Um, and the macros are freaking amazing. 16 fat, uh, 10 protein, and 15 carbs. So it's really balanced uh, macro-wise and it just tastes really good. I pretty much eat this like one bag after like a meal as like my dessert. So this is what I'm gonna be eating right now while I wait. Um, but yeah, it's 145. We should be done around 435. And then I think I might do a workout here after. So we'll see. Um, but yeah, that was a quick update. I'll see you guys in the next clip. They are shooting Alex a little bit more now. Um, I think this might be like the second to last shot. We're doing some cable work, but I just want to come on and give you guys an update on what I'm doing. I'm literally sitting on the floor of the gym doing some work on my phone, um, editing some videos, putting up some content for Instagram, which by the way, if you're not following me on Instagram, make sure you're following me on Instagram. Um, it's just Yami Mufti. I post a lot of workout videos now and um, it's mostly workout videos and just motivational content and stuff like that. So uh, make sure you're following me on that. But for now, I think I'm gonna do this <laughs> until it's my turn to go. I love this and I love being a part of this company and um, this has just been a huge blessing. So I'm very, very thankful. Uh, but for now, I'm just gonna uh, keep doing what I'm doing. I will say I am getting a little bit hungry now, so. I think I might go get dinner after this right away because I'm hungry. Uh, but yeah, that's it. I'll update you guys in a little bit. Day in the life of a bodybuilding.com athlete. Looking sad with her med ball. I'm <laughs> so happy with my med ball. Almost done. Almost done. Then we get to eat. Are you zooming in on her? Yep. <laughs> That's a wrap. <laughs> That's a wrap. <laughs> hey friends.
friends, I finally made it back to the hotel room and I am so tired. My feet hurt and I'm starving. My plan is to just order some Uber Eats and get some work done, I'm trying to get myself um, caught up again from shooting these past two days and not being able to do anything. So I'm just gonna order some food and work on this comfy bed. But I did wanna come on and just say one last thing before I close the video. I feel very blessed and very fortunate to come to Boise and shoot for bodybuilding.com and Optimum Nutrition. For those of you that don't know, I, I started on bodybuilding.com as a consumer. I actually did one of their challenges a couple years ago. I think it's like four years ago now. And it's just crazy to think of my journey and now that I'm actually an athlete with bodybuilding.com, it just like, it's very humbling. And it reminds me that dreams are possible and if you work really, really hard, your goals can be accomplished. So if you're out there right now struggling, um, trying to get through, through whatever it is you're trying to get to, just just remember that you can get through it and you can reach those goals and you can get those dreams as long as you try and just go for it, you know? Um, it's crazy what, what happens when you work really hard and believe in yourself. So that's just my little takeaway for you guys. Do not give up on what you want because it just feels like because it may feel like it's not coming to fruition. It will come to fruition. Just keep on pushing, keep on trying, and it'll come. And if it doesn't come, something better will. That's just how it works. So um, I'm going to end the video right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you're following me on Instagram and YouTube. Make sure to let me know what you guys want to see on my channel. This channel is for you and only you. So let me know what you want to see and I will make sure to get that to you. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Mwah.